taking their faith into the fight. Tonight, an ecumenical gathering of believers from all across Texas met at the border for a candlelight vigil to pray for immigrant children who've been separated from their parents. Eyewitness News border reporter Oscar Margain has that story in McAllen. Approximately 300 people of all faiths gathering at the Texas-Mexico border for one purpose. Will in fact end the separation of immigrant parents and children at the border. Led by the Catholic Church, people of all walks and all ages holding their loved ones just a little closer. What if they were born in different country and, and it, it was my daughter with my wife or, or coming over and beyond my control, I would want someone uh, of good will to be taking care of my daughter and I'd cage her up in a cage. Adrian Hernandez, a McAllen resident, showed up with his father, wife and two daughters in solidarity to pray for migrant children currently in a shelter or a detention center. He's grateful President Trump has stopped further family separations. People began to light up their candles before they began their walk in silence to the McAllen Federal Court building a third of a mile down the road. The place dozens of immigrant adults arrive to every day to face prosecution for crossing the border illegally and whose punishment has been to see their children be taken away from them. And faith leaders reminding the faithful tonight that although the practice of separating families has ended, there are still thousands of children out here who tonight won't be tucked into bed by their mother or their father and that their social fight is not yet over. In McAllen on the Texas-Mexico border, I'm Oscar Margain reporting.